Okay, so here we are, day two for Rally America and the 100 Acre Wood Rally, and we're here with second place currently and our snowdrift winner, David Higgins, in the Subaru USA team. Uh, so the roads were really dry yesterday. We haven't had a lot of moisture in the region uh, this winter. How were things for you on stage yesterday? Yeah, it was a bit tricky, really, because we were running um, the front of the field, and we, there was a lot of road cleaning going on. The, the line was being swept, definitely, for the cars behind. Um, we, we, and obviously... The weather caught us a little bit by surprise. The roads were much harder than what we thought. Where we tested the, the soft tyre that we that we ran on was perfect and no problem. But then when we tried it yesterday morning, it, it just blistered up and we had a big problem on the first three saves with this. And then the second group of saves, when the dust, when the the, the dark came, we, we had real bad dust last night. Um, and we got it probably worse than what Ken did because Ken had the bit of a gap when Antoine had retired. He had a four-minute window and we, we were running to a two-minute window plus on the long save we took almost a minute out of Christoph so we were basically running with a minute window so the dust really hampered us last night but in saying that we didn't want to be first on the road today um, we would have preferred to be a little bit down and the, and the strategy was always to try and be second or third on the road but in striking distance and you know we're a little bit further away than what we wanted to be on Ken but in saying that Ken's speed on the on the real fast stage is, is phenomenal so um, we've got no match for that on the real high speed stages but We'll just see if we can keep the pressure going and obviously got to look at the bigger picture now with the championship now Antoine's retired. We need to make sure we pull the points in. Yeah, so that's with Antoine being out with the transmission issues that he had, is the is the idea gonna be push push to try and take the win or is it just gonna or is it gonna be a nice settled pace for maybe, you know, second place just take the points? Well the points are important because it's a it's a big it's a long it's a championship with no drop scores, so we need to we put ourselves under a lot of pressure last year with a DNF in the first round and it'd be nice to try and have that buffer um, going on. But in the saying that it also takes a little bit of pressure off because you know, if we, but, but, but we we need we need to get the points basically. But in, but I want to keep pressure on on Ken and you know see what happens. Like he's had five victories on this rally. He knows how to win this event, but, and it's the only event that I haven't won of the Rally America Championship. So um, I, I want my name on that trophy as well. But I, I'm not going to do anything stupid to try and do it. Yeah, yeah. And now you have had the opportunity to rally really all over the world, uh, British champion, and now you've come over to the U.S. and had success uh, as well with the Subaru. Uh, how does the competition here in the United States stack up with some of the competition around the world that you've experienced previously? Yeah, no, it's pretty, um, obviously, British championship over the last few years has been pretty poor, really. There's been, a, there's, it hasn't had the, the depth that they've had before, and I haven't been involved in it for that long, but um, in China, which I was for the last five years, was no media coverage whatsoever for, for foreign drivers but in saying that the competition was very very strong there was 10 drivers in every event that could possibly win a rally um, so that was really tough but you didn't really get any credit for it here the, the pace of the front is absolutely right up there it's very very fast but after the sort of the first three cars it tends to be a bit of a bit of a gap but in saying that to, to be in a position to win over here you still have to be full on it the speed's good the cars are quicker the roads are generally quicker as well so it's a different type of rally uh, for sure well we really appreciate it wish you the best of luck today and for the rest of the championship thank so. you good to talk to you all right